What's going on guys, JSQ here and welcome to a Minecraft 1.15 tutorial showing you all about these bee nests and bee hives. Now, before we get started, I'd appreciate if you smash that like button and also subscribe if you haven't already for more epic content like this. So, um, bee nests, it all starts with these. So, what these are, they hang from oak and birch trees. Um, they're the only trees that they spawn on. These are the bee nests that naturally generate, by the way. So um, they can only be found in plains, sunflower plains, and flower forest biomes. Um, and in general, it says here that um, flower forest biomes are the most common place because there's just more trees there. Um, and also there's 5% chance for the tree to contain a bee nest. So yeah, I'll also get on to crafting it now. So what you need is six planks of any kind and you need three honeycomb. I'll show you how to get honeycomb in a second. Um, but before we do that, I'll just quickly show you the crafting recipe. So it's three blanks on top, three blanks on the bottom, and then honeycomb in the middle, and that'll craft a beehive. You can't actually craft bee nests, which are these things here, which are naturally generating. So beehives, they house three bees at a time, same with bee nests as well. The bees fly into the nest during rain, night, and after they've pollinated. Um, once they've got a flower, they'll fly into the beehive and disappear and do their, do their thing. A silk touch, it keeps the beehives inside. Otherwise, um, if you break them with an axe or something, it will make them aggressive, basically, and attack you. If I just quickly, like, put that beehive down, you can see how different it looks to the bee nests. So, um, yeah, the bees will fly into that as well if they want to. Um, so, also, just a general note about harvesting them. So, this is how you get the honeycomb that can be used to craft the beehives themselves. Um, so you can use shears, a glass bottle, and a campfire, which is pretty interesting, which I'll go through in a sec. So um, if you have, if you right-click on a, a beehive that has like the dripping honey from it and also the yellow bits on the side, um, that means it's ready to harvest. So essentially, each time a bee goes in there after pollinating, it levels up. So if you start from a base one that doesn't have like the yellow bits inside, I'll quickly show you actually. It looks like that. So that means it's like sort of not ready to harvest yet. And each time a bee goes in after pollinating, it will level it up to one. Once it gets to level five, essentially, it will be ready to harvest like this. And these three are ready to harvest now, which I prepared earlier. If you don't want them to get aggravated when you mine them or harvest them, you have to put a campfire underneath like that. And that will essentially keep the bees inside. Or I don't know if it scares them off. I can't remember how real life actually works. But if we start with a honeycomb, we can right click on there and it'll give us, if I can get up here, it'll give us three honeycombs and it hasn't actually aggravated the bees. Another way to also get it is uh, into a honey bottle. And then that's aggravated them because I haven't put campfire down. Oh, they've gone all red eyed and not very nice. So yeah, you want to put a campfire underneath if you want to collect collect honey basically <laughs> but uh yeah that's everything you really need to know about uh, bee nests and bee hives and how to craft them and find them and all that so uh yeah thank you so much for watching guys uh, appreciate it if you smash that like button just to show support for the video and also comment your uh, thoughts on bees they've been around in modded for a while but obviously never been advanced as this so it's pretty cool to see but yeah thank you so much for watching guys and i'll see you in the next one peace